Alrighty, we're going to try something different tonight. We're going to use a Canon 80D with that Tamron 18-400mm lens, but we're putting a 2X uh, teleconverter on it. And we tried this uh, last year, and the planets came out pretty well, even though you lose uh, two stops of light. But I do have to do a bit of setup here first, so... I shall be back. Well, now I think I might leave a little bit of this uh, footage in to stop some of the bitching trolls. <laughs> and just do a fast forward here of the uh, setup and, and the shakiness and all the other bullshit that I edit out to make a nicer video. But uh, some folks just don't like it. But uh, yeah. I'll just do a real quick fast forward here. <laughs> my oh my. Can't please everybody. Okay, so there we go. On the Canon 80D with that Tamron lens and the 2X teleconverter. We do have the Skywatcher mount set up and uh, tracking Jupiter. And we are recording on the Atomos Ninja Flame. Let's check the info here. I said it's at 320. And again, with the Canon 80D, you are able to use a 10x digital zoom. So whatever all that adds up to, that's where we're at. <laughs> it looks close in size to what the P1000 gets at max zoom. I really like using the uh, Canon just because it's easier to change the shutter speed and all that stuff during re uh, live recording. But we'll try to blow it out here and get the uh, moons of Jupiter in. Let me pull up this Sky Safari Pro app and see who we have here. Sorry, it's so grainy, but that's what you get when you have a ISO up so high. But in this view, we have Jupiter and Io and then Ganymede at the very bottom. And I don't see Callisto on the app, so it must be on the back side of the planet. So there's that. Oh, anyway, <laughs> here we are on Sunday, June 23rd, 2019, at 9.23 p.m. in northeastern Ohio, and this is our southeast sky. Okay, try to center it. <clears throat> Excuse me. And yeah, it's not the best view, but uh, we can see the bands of Jupiter. So it's not the quality a telescope can get, but hey, we'll take it. Now it's still pretty light out, so it's not even a dusky blue yet. <laughs> but the sun went down probably about 20 some minutes ago. But that's cool. I want to try something different, and there we go. And we'll go back in and take off the zoom. And bring the lens back. Alrighty, I think we have the planet in focus now, but it is a grainy image. <laughs> okay, so Saturn and Pluto, which are pretty close together, won't be rising for about another 20-some minutes, and uh, but it'll take a while for them to crest all these trees and everything so but it'll be in the general area where Jupiter is right now once it does and by that time Jupiter will be over to the right over by the willow tree <laughs> but I'm sorry I think I'll have to uh, call it a early night because last night I stayed up way too late reviewing footage and 
doing the edits and all that and finally getting it transcoded and then uploaded and all that kind of good stuff and I think it was after 5 a.m. when I was finally able to get to bed. So we're going to call it an early one here with just good old Jupiter and our testing of the teleconverter here on the Canon 80D. I think it came out pretty well for losing a couple stops of light and all that. Anyway, I'm going to wave goodbye for now and I hope you all have a great start to your new week tomorrow. Goodbye from Ohio. Night night.